Hey, Cam. Good evening. This is Charles Grievous with GoBlackNights.com. How are you doing? I'm doing well. I'm doing well, sir. How are you doing? Great, great. Just a couple questions for you. Uh, you know, coastal spread option uh, offense average, I think, approximately about 40 points, about 490 yards a game last year and was ranked fifth nationally in total offense overall, and fourth in scoring offense, if you will. Uh, talk about what you guys have to do to stop them offensively or defensively. I'm sorry. As you saw, like watching, um, watching them like all last year, they're a very dynamic offense, very well run. Like they know what they're doing. Um, in order for us to be successful, we just can't beat ourselves. Like we preach that all the time. Like only Army can beat Army. Great. And again, you talk about they have a veteran team coming back offensively. Uh, their quarterback, uh, Grayson McCall, is the real deal. Uh, what have you noticed about? Uh, what he brings to the table in, in terms of studying his film, uh, studying the offense. Uh, he definitely he know like he runs a, um, their offense very well, like perfect fit basically, and he has control of he has control over everything. Great, thank you very much. Hey Cam, Ken McMillan with the Times Herald Record. How's it going? Good. Hey, do you like starting the season with a game like this? Um, definitely, sir. It's always a, it's always great to start the season off with a challenge. It's a great test to see where your team, where the team is physically and mentally heading into the uh, remaining of the season. Mm -hmm. Would you say it was a good camp? Uh, I would say it was a great camp. We have a, a lot of freshmen who caught our eye and um, exceeded our expectations right away, which is a good, always a good thing because depth is always a, um, our friend. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about the de defensive secondary? Um, I feel great about this de uh, defensive secondary. Um, yeah, it's basically the same as last year, uh, minus Sid and Julian, but we have Bo and uh, Q Hammond stepping up, fill right in uh, where we left off. Mm -hmm. What should be the expectations for Army this fall? Um, I guess you guys will find out. <laughs> well, I mean, okay, then get, just give me a, a pulse of the team. Is this team like uh, excited or kind of well, like trying to figure out? Yeah, team is definitely excited. Uh, to be honest, I feel like we're more close, more uh, bonded more than uh, we were last year, honestly. I think, I think we'll do very well this year. Was that necessary? Was that something that you guys kind of set out as a goal? Um, it's always a goal, like on any team you're on. Like the closer you are, the more you know your team, the better off you will. You like better off you will be. I know you've been practicing for three weeks, but what's it like to wait this long to finally play ball? What's the anticipation like? Um, to be honest, it feels like it uh, it can't come sooner enough. Like the anticipation, especially on the the like, actual game week, is crazy. I couldn't sleep last night. Mm -hmm. And last thing on you, uh, just tell me, how'd you feel you did in camp? What did you work on? Did you feel like you made improvements? I'm um, definitely, I feel like I definitely made improvements. Um, for me, I feel like I just need to focus on the, um, the little things, the little details in the technique to get it right and perfect that to help me help the team. Mm -hmm. All right. Appreciate the time tonight. Thanks. Is that it?